fade back in on Harborvale, a coastal town striving to rebuild. Its residents tread warily on the unsteady ground that has eroded beneath their feet. Despite the community's tenuous air of relief and recovery, there are still so many secrets to unveil. Secrets of an ancestral curse and the struggle to contain it. Secrets of vengeance biding their time. Secrets of alluring control washed onto the shore. Secrets of the beast within and the desire to release it. And as we tear back the veil of these silent secrets, we shall uncover the truth of what it requires to live beside the bay. Hello, and welcome to these Silent Secrets. My name is Zach, and I will be your MC. Where last we left off, the soup group in school, I believe on a Thursday, Jason just turned in his paper that was switched out for Billy Joel lyrics. And more specifically, where we left off was with Kanan walking down the hall and a fist landing squarely against their jaw. So, with that in mind, content warning that this episode of These Silent Secrets just really dives right in there with a sequence of violence. Before we dive into the episode further, a couple thanks to get through. Ghostlight Media, thank you so much for having us. We love being here. We're very, very excited. And of course, to Nicole Tuttle Rob for all her work and scoring and doing our socials and our merch and stuff. She's absolutely incredible, deserves all the praise. My cast, thanks for being awesome. A bit of a event to keep on your horizons coming up here at the start of next month, so November, that's uh, uh, the weekend of the 3rd, 4th, and 5th, a bevy of us will be at Akatacon in Dayton again. We'll put links uh, up in the description. Um, for info on uh, going to that, if you'd be interested, we should be doing a couple of panels when we have more info of those as well, I'll let you know. And, um, yeah, if you're interested, come check it out. It should be really fun. We'll be around, and you can come say hi. But with all that out of the way, all that's left is the episode. So let's dive in to this here episode of These Silent Secrets Beside the Bay. Oh, gang, it's been, um... Uh, it, it, uh, 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 <laughs> I looked everybody's face. <laughs> what? It's yeah, been. It's been. <laughs> uh, uh, see, I I was about to make a. It's been a while, goof. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like Too ours is. Yeah, it's been. <laughs> also, r- rest in peace, that guy. That's bare naked ladies, not That's... Smash Mouth. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. You're totally right. I will. <laughs> he Smash Mouth. What? Here's the thing. Here's How? The thing. Here's Zachary. the thing. This, the reason that I had that so ready <laughs> was that I was also that? about to say, rest in peace, <laughs> that guy. Wait a second. That's oh, a okay. Man. So I just beat you to the idiocy. Oh, my no, God. No, I, I stopped myself. Okay, that's what I'm saying. I, 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 I said it. Yeah. My goodness. All right. <sighs> starting strong. Here we are. Um, starting really, really strong. Remember, excellent. guys, I'm, 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 I'm feeling very vulnerable today. <laughs> Please don't dunk on me too hard. Just excellent. <laughs> Uh, I think goodness. we're going to call everything you do a stinker, actually. Oh, yeah. oh, it's, it's kind of a stinker. <laughs> <laughs> ah. it's, listening, back that, it, it, yeah. listening back to that is by far it's, uh, Freddy responding with, ooh, stinky joke. <laughs> <laughs> it was the funniest part of that whole thing. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Fucking hell. Ooh, all right, let's play some Monster Hearts. <laughs> <laughs> God, do we just want to dive in there today? It took yeah. us a bit to get rolling. Friends uh, at home, we've been battling through about 35 minutes worth of technical issues. If Bro. you subscribe to here. our Patreon, you can find a detailed itemized list of every technical <laughs> problem yeah, uh, we, that we had before Yeah, we episode. put in a lot 100%. of IT tickets, and you can download all those IT tickets at our Patreon. Patreon. Yeah, you just have to, you just have to make an account on Jira first, and then yes. from there... <laughs> Also, you I don't even know what that is. Fifteen dollars into our PayPal. <sighs> Any who's it? Uh, episode. 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 We rejoined the soup group. More specifically, Canaan. On Thursday, between second and third periods, they walk calmly but 
Unexpectedly, a fist comes from out of frame and crashes into their face. They reel backwards, hitting the lockers behind them. They bring a hand to their face and look back at their attacker. Gael stands close by, cracking their knuckles. Oh! You had to keep watching me, kid. I did nothing to you. Uh, and they are uh going to punch you again. <laughs> we'll, what the we'll fuck? Call that yeah. Take a harm from yeah, of like like a much harder than necessary punch. Like he is just chucking them. What's Listen, man, I'm not trying to fight you. What the fuck is your problem? I'm so sick and tired of Kane and Goody Two Shoes Talbot just keeping an eye on everything I fucking do lately. So you know what? Let's deal with this. Are you going through something right now, man? I like seriously, <laughs> like I don't want to fight. I'm not even trying to keep tabs on you. I'm just trying to make sure you're not fucking with people. Are you doing anything to stop them from advancing on you? If he's going to keep advancing, I'm going to... He gonna... is being very aggressive. If he tries to hit again, I'm going to try and, like, dodge out of the way and hit him back. Awesome. Give me... A, uh, yeah, make a lash out. Why not? Oh, boy. Howdy. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> oh, jeepers. You're really good at volatile, though, right? I mean, yeah. granted, you don't have your crazy moon shit. Oh, no! What, what'd you say? What'd you say? <laughs> no, that's a I rolled, Mark that I rolled a six. Oh, Mark that oh, experience, God. my friend. Um, yeah, it's one of those things, like, you know, that he goes in to punch you, and you, like, are, like sort of sidestep it, but, like, he kind of, like, like what's the word I'm like, like, pulled the punch, like, expecting you to move. And so, like, as you move, like, he just, like, hand on your chest, hand on, like, your neck just shoves you, and it's, like, one of those solid, like, <clears throat> as you sort of fall back on your back and squeak across the floor. Anyone else, you would probably hear at least, like, the scuffle of people in the hallway be like, oh, shit, there's a fight, as, uh, as this continues. Uh, I'm just gonna be like, you know what, man, this is what you want? Get your licks in. Get, go ahead. I'm not even gonna fight you. I know that's what you want. Do, do, do it. You feel big? Do it. Awesome. Uh, he does. Uh, yeah, you're on the ground. He comes up to you, uh, gives you one, one more punch across the face. Do you continue to do anything else? No, I'm just gonna, like, very creepily stare at him. Like, not, like, I know I'm being affected by the punches, but I'm not making a noise. I'm just staring at him, like, awesome. with that, uh, like, parent, uh, so, you done face. Yeah, Mark, uh, two more, um, two more harm, because he oh, is not letting up. Um, we are uh, too early to kill someone! <laughs> uh, never too early. Guile is going to use a move called Bully. When uh, when you use physical force to intimidate or harass, roll volatile instead of cold to shut someone down. He full uh, uh, full succeeds in shutting you down. So he, sh he punches you that one last time, grabs you by your shirt, and picks you up. Exactly. Stay on the ground like the little bitch you are. And he just drops you back onto the ground and walks away. So, um, you what? would get the, you then get the condition, little bitch. <laughs> Adding that to my notes. <laughs> um, Kanan, roll to keep your cool form. Oh, fuck, dude. Okay. And that is... Hey, this is going to be episode cold. seven. I need to kick this shit up. I had a weird thought while you're rolling this. So, we're at episode six, which is only a couple away from ten, which then puts us already a quarter into the length of last season yeah uh because we only did 40 episodes in the first season True. so like we're already almost a quarter to that which is horrifying what did we roll i got a nine partial a success. nine partial success very good for you kanan <laughs> you the first se uh, episode of the season we talked about a moment that happened to you over the summer when a chupacabra had attacked you and your aunt. Um, and your reflexes weren't quick enough. Your aunt took care of things, but that instinct inside you stirred, almost in disappointment at your lack of readiness, your lack of instinct. Mm -hmm. You're feeling this, but uh, you, I guess even more stronger. Not to the point where like it's like overwhelming you because you managed to succeed but even you know partially um but that dominance that sort of primal force that nature the nature of who you are sort of you've kept a tamp on for most of your life but you've sort of started to embrace 
is mm -hmm. reeling with disgust and disappointment that you just sat there that you let this guy just mess you up and you did nothing about it okay um the rest of you who come running uh if you do come running i don't know when you heard that there was a fight do you do anything i do something different okay what doth you do so i see that like people are running towards this fight yeah. um the office do the people in the office, like admin as well, leave and kind of like clear out to go towards this as well? Um, I don't think like, you know, they're you know in their offices. I don't think they've uh, heard news of the scuffle yet. I will rush into the f office there. Go, ha, there, there's uh, there's a fight going on right now. It's bad, bloody, uh, gross. Mops and police probably go. Awesome. Yeah. Um, you, uh, uh, popping out of her office, you see, uh, Principal Melia Abbas, uh, who is like, all right, show me the way. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's, it's that way. I can't, I'm queasy. Sorry. Uh, I'm going to, but yeah, thank it's, you. It's that okay. Way. Thank you for letting us know. Mm -hmm. And, uh, she takes off in that direction. Jason, Isla, do you do anything hearing news of a fight in the hall? I'm just going to go check out the fight. Awesome. You go to check out the fight. <laughs> and it's one of those things like where you know, a lot like when people are like, ooh, there's a fight, and then they get there. And you know, most high school fights only last like a couple of seconds. Yeah. So by the time you get there, like like people seem to start uh dispersing already. Um, but you do see Kanan uh, laying, you know, uh, uh face up on the floor, uh their face uh bloody. You can already see the, the beginnings of bruising starting. Uh, I'm just like run over like like skidding slide down towards Kane. I'm like, dude, what the fuck happened? You okay? I'll, I'll be fine. I just... <laughs> you... <laughs> you sound awful. I know I do. Uh, I <laughs> kind of got my ass beat just now. And yeah. I can my jaw's smell. a little swollen. Um, yeah. But, you know, I didn't... <laughs> they go low, you go high, right? <laughs> With that, I love. Is there anything that you do? <laughs> yeah. So, like, when I hear that there's a fight, I'll go over there, I'll come around the corner, and maybe I'm like towards the back of the group. Yeah. But I'm seeing it happen, and I slowly take my phone out of my pocket and hit record. World star. <laughs> throwback yeah you probably catch like the last like you know the the um the moment that like kanan got like shoved back onto uh back onto their back and gael climbed on top and punched a couple times and said a few things and then walked off you probably yeah caught all that uh and then yeah i think up until the point of jason uh, arriving and that bit of a conversation then i think Happened. i'll like dink off and nice join to kanan and be like that looked harsh Hey, well, I tell you what, I feel worse than I look. That's bad. <laughs> you look. Oh awful. no, I, I wasn't. I wasn't saying it as a positive. <laughs> but okay, let's get you to the nurse. Come on. Okay. <laughs> get, get up, fucking I feel Rocky. worse than I look. That's bad. <laughs> um, in the freshly vacated office i would like to sneak in bro incredible <laughs> oh my god let's go all right what are you doing um yeah so i want personnel files that's what i want on okay. on the stew crew on the stew crew all right uh roll to keep your cool whilst you're doing this yeah that, that's probably um, a good point let's do that okay what is my cool i hope it's good i don't think it's great babe um I don't okay. call you babe on, re on, on recording often. That was a bit strange, I gotta say. Gross. Um, <laughs> okay, so it's a minus one. <laughs> Darn it. Okay, so that is only a seven. Um, okay. Seven. That's a seven. Okay. Uh, it, it, you said that's only a seven. And then you stopped talking. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> so, <because. laughs> so I was like, is there more to that sentence? No, I was done. <laughs> that was it. Uh, <laughs> said what I needed to. <laughs> So that is a seven. Uh, so that's a seven. Uh, that's kind of a say, you you slink into sort of like the main office. You see like the secretary isn't around at the moment. Um, and yeah, you start digging through uh, through some filing cabinets. 
you do the classic, like, you know, fingers walking down the thing as you're looking for, mm-hmm. for you know, last name, comma, first names. And I think, yeah, with a partial success, Nicole, this is what I want you to do. Uh, I, need, I want you to roll me 2d4 right now. I thought with I'd... a partial success, I think you only get to a, get to a couple of them before, like, you need to dip the fuck out of there. Two. Oh, like, like what was the total? One on the each. First one? one on each. <laughs> uh, re-roll one of those. Okay. Three. Three. Awesome. Give me a moment. All right. So you get um, the files for Sophia and uh, Gia, uh, oh yeah, Gia and Nina. So Gia and, nice. and Sophia. Perfect. I am going to kind of, I stick it in like the back waistband of my jeans and put the leather jacket over top of them so awesome. that they're hiding in, on my back and then I will walk out yeah, of the I office. Yeah, I think it's like one of those things like j- like you're behind the counter and uh, I, we haven't come up with who your secretary's name is. I want to say her name is Miss Hudson. Love and that. And she's just a nice, a nice middle-aged woman. It's like, oh, what can I do for you? Oh, Back I was... there, behind yeah. the counter where you, where you shouldn't be. I know. I... <sighs> This is kind of embarrassing. Um, I was hiding from there. There was a fight in the hallway, and I just oh, yeah. I just violence it, gives me makes me queasy too. I get right. It, it, it is yeah. hard to live with sometimes. Okay, well, hey, I believe yeah. It sounds like Principal Abbas went to you know break stuff up. So oh, yeah, I goodness. think you'll be good. Yeah. yeah. No, I appreciate all the hard work you do here, Mrs. Hudson. Oh, stop! 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 Mm-hmm. Uh, I feel like Avery last year when she was on this like kick of like, you know, lunch office. Um, I feel like she's had conversations with Mrs. Hudson before. So Avery kind of digs deep into the wells of things that she knows and may have gotten before via Raven stuff Mm -hmm. and just goes and like, I, I really hope that you've been able to talk to your sister since last we talked. Oh, honey, thank you. Yeah, we've we've reconciled. I didn't know that you knew about that. Thank you so much. That's wonderful. Um, uh, anyway, I gotta go. Uh, thank you so much. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, there's a moment, like, where the camera says, You're such a sweet girl. <laughs> Yes, violence makes me cut. queasy, but I killed someone last year. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> back at back at the fight. Um, yeah, uh, Principal Abbas uh, rolls uh, in the hallway. All right, what the hell is happening? You know, the the, the sea of students parts sees uh, sees you three sort of down on the ground. So okay, get up off the ground. Someone get uh, Chen get Talbot to the nurse's office. I'm working on it. Arm over shoulder, the classic, just like, let's get you. Yeah. There. Yeah, yeah. It's one of those things. Like, she's essentially like escorting you as as you like carry Kanan uh, down the halls. Um, you get deposited in the nurse's office, and she's like, all right, so what happened? Jesus, God. Jason, what the hell happened? Someone, I don't know, I wasn't there to see who it was, got in a fight with Kanan. Uh, Kanan got beat up real bad. I was can it? see that. <sighs> Hold Do on. we know who this other kid was? Get, Jason, like, goes over to Kanan and kind of, like, leans in a little bit. Was it, was it Kanan? Kind of? I'm not going to say. I, I disagree with this, but I respect it. I don't know who I, he hasn't been, they haven't been able to tell me yet either because of the mouth. All I'm sure right. someone else saw it. Right, if I give you a pen and paper, will you write it down? I hold up my hands as if they hurt. They don't, but I hold them up as if they do. God, God. All right. I'm going to, I'll, I'll be calling on you later. She, you know, pinches the bridge of her nose and, and heads out the door. God. And uh, leaves you in the nurse's office. Why is it a secret? Th- it's it's going to be easy knowledge. I know, but if I'm the one that says it, he's just going to come back on me. And honestly, I want to get him back. Those, 
those statements conf- if he comes back to get you then you can get him back yeah but i want to i want to bide my time a bit and do it my own way you sound a little like dreepy dog <laughs> Oh, I'm going to get him back. Don't you worry. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> new new canon voice. Oh permanent. my god! Just droopy. Is that yeah, whatever you turn that's into? That's the a new voice. Yeah, that's yeah, the yeah, werewolf voice. Yeah. 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 Just yeah. droopy dog. Are you ready to get clawed in the face? <laughs> <laughs> You shouldn't oh, have punched God. me like that, gal. <laughs> God. This is, listen, if you subscribe oh. to our Patreon, we will do an entire <laughs> mini episode with Kanan with We that have voice. alternate versions of all of our previous episodes where Kanan yeah, yeah, has we'll, redubbed we'll, all of their previous We'll lines. recast all the characters as Hannah Barbara, uh, Bar- uh, Barbara cartoons. No, no, I like Hannah Barbara better. <laughs> Hannah Barbara. <laughs> Hannah Barbara. Thank you. <laughs> Quick, uh, th- who's who's everyone's Hannah Bar- Barbara? Uh, oh, I'm always. Oh God, is it Huckleberry Hound? Uh, exit, stay, is left. That's Snagglepuss. Snagglepuss. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Heavens to Megatron. He- <laughs> Heavens to <laughs> Betsy. I literally can't do impressions to save my life. So, Avery... but I just want to know what character it would be. Oh, yeah, let, who me would it best, be? let me hear your best. Let me hear your best uh, Yogi Bear. I just told you I can't do impressions. Well, I just, just want to hear your best. I listen, listen. I know that that would make hilarious content, but <laughs> my ego cannot take it. Okay, you know what? That's fair. What about say- Scooby Doo? Your your mom calls you Scoob. Yeah, no, I can't fucking do the voice though. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like I'm just throwing it out there, and then we can get back to the actual game. But I just got to say it. Jason is 100% Jabberjaw. <laughs> I'm trying to think of who Jabberjaw is. The shark, the big ass shark. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Incredible. Oh, man. Uh, Isla, do you go with them to the nurse's office? Uh, yeah. Um, you uh, get a text from Grimm while you're in there. It says, I have an idea. Meet me in the office after third period. I text back a thumbs up emoji. Nice. Incredible. Avery, do you do anything else? Uh, does, does anyone do anything else right now? Kanan, you got the shit kicked out of you. Are you going to your next class or are you going to go home? Oh, I'm. Go- oh man, I actually kind of don't want to go home because I'm a parent. I'm going to leave school, but I'm not going to go home. I'm going to go to like, like a bookstore or a coffee shop, somewhere I can just be alone. For a minute, mm-hmm. cool. Jason's like, "Are you, are you sure that's a good idea? Someone's gonna like call someone if you walk into like a bookstore, like bleeding out your <sighs> eyes." You raise a very good point. I'll go home. Um. All right. So we go back in, in into class, shifting around. We'll say that yeah. The uh, uh, the next class period ends. Isla, do you go to meet Grim? Yeah. Awesome. Um. Yeah. You uh um sort of are walking up to the office, and right at the moment, you see Mrs. Hudson, the secretary, is leaving the office for a bit, and you see Grim, who's just kind of you know uh, uh standing by the door, uh. Just uh, post it up, like, you know, a real, real shit, you know, shit lean kind of vibe of just like, they're like a cool kid. Um, and you get there. I'm so glad you're here. I had a terrific idea. Come with me. And she walks into the office, you know, uh, uh, without hesitating behind the uh, the front, like the desks, like the, you know, the front counter of the office um, to where like the thing that w- the PA would like the, the, the microphone with the big button on it. Mm-hmm. So, you know, we were talking about, you know, making Harper Vale into, like, something incredible, right? Yes. And so, like, I, I, I got the email that you're back in the studio later today. So, I, I don't know if it's, has it, if it's been a while since, like, you've stretched your muscles. Wink, wink, wink. Maybe you want to take, like, a little, you know, like a little, like a sam- like a survey size. Uh, just to kind of see, like, what you can, like, like, just, like, what Hart's got to offer. Hmm. Like a morning announcements kind of thing? 
like a morning announcement sort of thing, but then you put in a little bit of whatever it is that you do and just kind of see what, what we can cook up. Do you have any ideas? I mean, it could be something, you know, either innocuous, like you know, making everyone, um, like, I don't, I, I don't know exactly what you could do. I just know that you can kind of sort of get in everyone's head a little bit. And so, like, you know, if you just do that, like, a little, just as, like, a, like a little tester before we get on, like, the big leagues on the radio later, it might be helpful. Hmm. It's tempting. It's just a thought. Why not? So I'll sit down at the PA. Yeah, she steps aside and sort of gives you a big gesture to the, the to the PA microphone. <clears throat> a big flourish to sit down. And I will, like, count down from three and then hit the... Yeah, yeah. She gives you the five, four. What's up, Malcolm Senior High School? It's your host, Isla Hart. How are we doing today? Let me hear ya. Silence. <laughs> I would say you actually, I, I, like, from, like, a few, um, uh, like, in the hall, you know, the couple of people that got, like, that are nearby, like, you hear a couple, woo! Like, you're kind of a big deal on the radio. Like, Cooper yeah, definitely, like, be- like cheers oh. the loudest. <laughs> yeah, Cooper's in front of the windows. It's like, yeah! I will hurt! What uh, month is this? Is this the beginning it of school is- year? Um, yeah, it's the beginning of school, so it's like, you know, what, late September, beginning of September usually, right? Is when, like, late when August, September. early September. Yeah, yeah. Late, uh, early, yeah late August, early, yeah, we'll say it's the, yeah, the beginning of September. Now, guys, we can't just let summer get away from us, can we? No, we cannot, Iowa! <laughs> so, why don't we celebrate being back at this drab senior high school? with a pool party at the school pool right now and i'll use what would that be oh uh, that's what your copper wire fire or whatever or it, your haunting melody that you can i guess use it would be yeah i guess it would be haunting for. melody someone this they go wild. where i tell them to later okay i've never wanted a role to succeed as much as this i one. want this to go <laughs> so well <laughs> oh god don't jinx me. all of us just like fingers crossed Come on. I believe it is a nine. in the heart of the cards. It's a nine. It's a nine, so I choose one. So I'll say the crowd goes to where you tell them to afterwards. Oh, incredible. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Copper wire fire. Add plus one to your rolls when you're haunting Melody for recording or broadcast. So it's a full success. There we go. Full success. Oh, yeah. I love when that happens. God, that was the best possible idea, too. Oh, my God. I'm so happy. Thank you. Yeah, you... Um, uh, like obviously Cooper's outside the window goes, yes, I love this idea. Just like holds a high five out to whoever he's passing the hallway. They totally don't see it and walk right past him. He slaps Aww. his own hand. All right. All right. See you in there. He looks back at you. I'll see you in there, Isla. And he heads straight for the pool. Um, but you can see like a lot of people, like even like teachers that have heard the announcements, like everyone is heading to, to the Nat to go swimming. Now. Hell yeah. <laughs> Um, so of my two other ones, I'm going to choose someone in the crowd gives me a string. Okay. I don't know if you'd like to choose that or... It would be fun. Take one on Sophia. Why not? Oh, that's a pleasant surprise. I will wow. do that. Who did you think it was going to be? Cooper. Cooper? Oh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> um, no, yeah, I'll give you one on Sophia. Why not? And then, well, she's new to this school, and now some weird shit's happening. I think that's a, a funny reason to be like, what the what? Is it what? Oh, okay. Right. And then, just because I want to see what happens, someone gives me a gift. Someone gives you a gift. Okay, I'll keep that in mind, and I'm going to hit you with that gift here in a bit. How about that? Good deal. Uh, but yeah, uh, school seems to have grinded to an ultimate halt, uh, and a pool party it, it seems to be beginning in, uh, in, <laughs> at, the, at the pool. Um, we'll, uh, check in on what's happening there in a bit. Uh, Kanan, you leave school. Mm-hmm. Missing the pool party, unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but you're heading home. Yeah. Awesome. So, yeah. yeah. Do I get so jumped you... again? Like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, on the way, a different person shows up and beats you up. No, no, you get home. Um, I think uh, Maddie hasn't left for college yet. Like, the school year hasn't kicked off yet. Uh, and so you walk in, and she's like, what the fuck happened to you? I got beat up. 
No shit! Sit down! Holy fuck! Yeah, yeah, yeah. she sort of moves about getting things together to help patch you up a bit. Uh, you can uh, heal to harm uh, during that. Woohoo! What is going on? There's this guy at school that... He's been picking on people. I kind of confronted him about it. He gave me shit, and I've just been keeping an eye on him, and he got mad at me for keeping an eye on him. He started to fight, and then I just kind of figured, you know what, I'm not going to play his game. And then uh, that didn't work. Yeah. Yeah, she, like, you know, like pulls you into the bathroom and shows you, this right here, this is why you don't just, like, let it happen. Kick his ass next time. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get him okay, back. Okay, good. But I also don't want to do it at school where I can get suspended. Smart. Jesus Christ, Kay. Yeah, I know. All right, but... well, go fucking... I'll bring you some ice. Go lay down. Okay, thanks, sis. I appreciate it. Yeah, she gets you set up with some with some ice packs and shit as you sort of flop down on the <laughs> couch or whatever. And I just, like, like the... Quintessential uh, ice pack on the head. Yeah. Like, uh, uh. Uh, yeah, keep that on there for a bit. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, back at school. Avery, you stole some files. Yes, Where I did. Where are you off to? I'm assuming like most of the school, are you heading towards the pool? Um, Am I? Like, so a question. Am I compelled to go to the pool party? I, I, it, I'm assuming you heard the thing. And so I think you are. Okay. That that changes everything for me then. So because I was because oh, I was right. headed to my lunch office. I was gonna oh, I was gonna reopen for business. You're um, gonna reopen for business just for me though. Literally just okay. me. <laughs> but now that it's the pool, I think. Oh no, um, I go by. No, I'm. Uh, <laughs> everything's changing. I text the group, the group Kay. chat. And I go, is there a plan happening at the pool? Question mark. Send. Do I need to bring anything? Question mark. Send. And then I will stop at my lunch office, hide the files, and then go to the pool. Cool. Love that. Kanan just Jason. texts back the like sick Ooh. emoji and that's it. <laughs> I I put a question mark in there because... I just heard there was a fight. I had no idea it was Kanan. She has no idea that it was Kanan <laughs> at all. That's fair. So I just like question mark. I send the video. <laughs> Avery calls Kanan. I, I don't answer. <clears throat> I, I like texted that emoji and then just kind of like threw my phone down and I'm just ice pack on the face. Like, this, this is the message that you get whenever you look at your phone again. <laughs> Kanan? What, why didn't you... What happened? Do I need to kill someone? I should not say that that loud. I don't... Um, Please ignore this message after the beep. Goodbye, beep! <laughs> Provided your own beep. <laughs> please ignore this after the beep, so everything before the beep yeah. will not get ignored? <laughs> I didn't say every smart. <laughs> it feels worse than it looks. <laughs> That's bad. Um, but yeah, uh, so Avery, Avery leaves that message, tries to figure out how to delete it, <laughs> doesn't doesn't get it right, and then goes to the pool. Jason, are you going to the pool? Uh, I feel like Jason misses those messages because he's already in the pool. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was given a reason and I took it. Very good. In my head, Ken and Jason was already in the pool and then the PA message came on. <laughs> Just and like, then oh, I, shit, then everyone's like, oh, coming dang, down? Nice. Now, this, is, this is Jason's private pool time. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. I had the whole pool reserved. <laughs> mm. uh, and uh, Isla, I'm assuming you also go to the pool party? Yes, but I'm going to sit on the edge. Yeah, I think Grim like, follows you down and, j and like it's just like looking, or giving you, like looking around at the room like, shit. Very good. It's a gift. I can tell. And it's one I think that is going, you're gonna really just take go you're gonna be going places like where i think that's an that's an expression you know it's like like you're gonna be incredibly successful like you're going places oh yeah 
Hmm, they should put that on a billboard. I'll look into it. Or on your radio, you could, on the radio tonight, you could have someone put it on a billboard. Or that could be my sign off. Put it on a billboard. That or I'm, I'm going, going places. places. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, understood, like, understood, understood. Good night. It's Isla Hart. I'm going places. So, like, I won't be here. I, I, I feel like I'm going to caution you against that because I feel like then people might think that you're being pretentious by claiming that, like, oh, I'm going places. You know what I mean? We're going places. You're going hmm. places? We's nice. It kind of emphasizes, like, a togetherness that I think is really, uh, like, really fits your kind of your niche well. Yeah. Yeah. The deep. <laughs> Getting deep. Getting deep with the deep. That sounds like something Avery would like. To get deep with the deep? Mm hmm She did a, a an advice column on my show once. How did that go? Well, emphasis on the once. <laughs> okay, so maybe we don't get her involved. She just needs a few more reps. I will leave that to your better judgment. And I'll push open both of the doors to the yeah. school pool. <laughs> yeah, Cooper's just like... And just like like a, like a big front flip, it lands flat on his back. There's a nice big <laughs> smack that happens. Yeah. It echoes. Everyone goes ooh. Um. I think to like make an excuse for me not getting in the pool. Is there like a like when they have swim meets? Like there's a PA system, like a sound system in. Oh yeah, definitely. Okay, so I'm gonna go over to that and hook my phone in hook, hook as phone is up, do some, episode do some music. one. Yeah. Full circle, baby. That's right. First, you take a video of a fight. Now you're DJing a party. We are just season one-ing all over the place. Exactly. Oh, I place. feel like I've been here before. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Yeah. No. Yeah. It, it, honestly, it kind of is jumping in here. Like you're pretty sure that it, you, whatever you did worked on the whole school. You see, teachers that like full dressed have jumped into the pool. Um, like, it's a, a fucking madhouse in here at the moment. Is it still 2009 or is it now 2010? It's 2010. Okay. It is, it is the, the fall of 2010. <laughs> I put on TikTok by Kesha. Oh, hell oh, yes. Yeah. So the party good. don't start till you walk exactly. in. Exactly. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, dude. Um, but yeah, that, that gets bumping. Everyone, yeah, it, like, it's just a weird middle of the day pool party. Um fucking wildness is happening is there anything that y'all want to do during this crazy ass pool party that is that currently transpiring jason you're in the, the pool i'm assuming yes yes awesome <laughs> i'm just having a good pool time you're just it's having great. a good pool time yeah i feel like cooper is uh is uh feverishly comes up to you and is like hey chicken we gotta get some chicken going you want to get chicken going oh we gotta awesome we gotta today's awesome. the day for fights yeah apparently. cooper is walking around just like Jason's asking like, anyone to 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 take part in it. I think surprisingly, Logan Harmon jumps in. Nice. I think I think there's a moment where Jason is like, should I feel weird that I'm at a pool party right after like my best friend got the shit got kicked, the kicked, out, kicked out, of out of him? And then Cooper comes back over and is like, we got people. And I'm like, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Zach, please tell me Cooper asks Avery to play chicken. Yeah. Oh no. Avery goes. Avery, you want to get in? <clears throat> Why? To play the play to have it's a pool it's a pool party it's for the fun to have the fun. For what game? Chicken. Oh, so you know that bird? Yeah. <laughs> what? Are you, what? Is this because of the raven? The yes, raven, it is. Uh, it will perfect? always come back to the raven, Cooper. Always. The, uh, they're hard to tell apart. Not if you are paying attention. I ha okay, I'll pay attention from now on. Come play chicken, please. Fine. And Aver will take off her leather jacket and just, like, toss it over and get in. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I think there's a, a, a moment where uh, uh, I think Cooper somehow talks in, uh, his way into being the top of the, the Cooper-Logan uh, team up. <laughs> um and so the, yeah, it, before it, the the awkward bit of like the bottom person having to like go under so that the person can get on their shoulders, like like she kind of she gives you like you know the the hey look, like you know she asked you on a date and like you haven't gotten back to her about it since so she's trying to respect your distance, you know your your, your personal space, so she's not bo bothering you. 
Um, and then, yeah, she she goes under, gets Cooper up on her shoulders. I look around. Is it just Jason and I on the other team? I, I, I think it, <laughs> at, at, team as this game. current matchup, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's a free Jason. Who's top and who's bottom here? Stop. <laughs> I think Avery. I'm sure our listeners have their own <laughs> thoughts on this. <laughs> Let us know. No. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> yeah, hit, hit, hit us up at Silent Secret Pod on on Twitter and on Blue Sky now. Officially, yeah. Whoop, whoop. We're there yeah. now. We out here, baby. Uh, is it is it at Silent Secret Pod still? No. <laughs> Was it now? <laughs> I think it's just these Silent Secrets. Oh, nice! Mm. I prefer that. Uh, Avery will look at Jason and go, how's your upper body strength? Good. Great. I'm in shape. And Avery will duck down. <laughs> oh, awesome. Uh, roll to, I'm going to, we're actually going to do a roll off here. We're going to do a volatile roll for whoever's up on it. Well, actually you both make a volatile roll and then these two will make volatile rolls. Just for the funsies. What is my tile? Oh, <laughs> not good. <laughs> Ooh, Jason did very, very well. That's oh shit! Great, wow, that was team. Incredi great incredi Cooper's incredibly arm. Well. <laughs> um, I rolled a nine. Nice. Jason just snaps his neck. Yeah, like, they the they, game? Pull, they pulled out a nine and a seven, so you guys come out victorious. Just hoisting Cooper up off of Logan. <laughs> Um, yeah, but so yeah, it, yeah, you know, they flop down. Uh, you, you, you are victorious. It's very good. Um, and then Avery, <laughs> um, you like, if you ever had like a moment, I'm guess I'm asking you, Nicole, for for um, just to frame your reference here, mm -hmm. like where like the smallest little prick of something kind of like really pisses you off. Oh like, yeah, just like something really small and like just like the most rage ignites in you. Yeah, you feel that oh, nice. just out of nowhere. Um, it's like one of those moments like you get you know you you Jason flops off your shoulders and he pumps out of the water and just something about it like you you feel it just like the prick on the back of your neck and just work like that that the heat just crinkles its way up, um and just Jason is just pissing you off right now for the purpose of this um nicole uh, uh, -huh. uh for the purpose of this you have essentially rolled uh, to fully uh succeed in shutting jason down how do you want to handle that uh, <coughs> hold on i'm blue screening um i also just thought of like the the one thing pissing you off it's like you're already having a bad day and then you go to walk out the door and your belt loop catches on the door handle it's that, that moment. That sucks. I fucking hate that <laughs> shit. It is that okay, moment so, where it's like, so yeah. I'm murdering the house. Uh, in, it's, everything's dead now. <laughs> in the um, background, Jason is like gloating over Cooper. Just like in the pool, just like yeah. arms above his head. He's like, oh, yeah. come on, yeah. man. Two out of three. Um, yeah, but so Avery, how do you uh, react in this moment, oh and uh, and then uh, choosing sort of you know from the from the the uh, role to shut someone down kind of options there? What do you do? Yeah, um, I think. Okay, wait. Remind me the options. I know. Uh, so your conditions. options are they they lose? Yeah. So you uh, 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 what is it? So yeah, they lose a string on you. They have no strings on you. Gain on uh, gain one on them. They gain a, uh, they gain a condition, or you take one forward. Do you have any strings on me, Jason? I'm pulling up these notes now. I think between I the have... two of you, neither of you do, because I think both of you got rid of all of them at one point. Yeah, I think I I still have two strings listed, but I think that they were both spent on uh, bringing you back to life. <laughs> I, that sounds correct. Valid. Okay. Um. Well, in that case, then I will take a string on Jason. Okay. And, well, and so yeah, what happens here? Just like punch in the water. So Avery looks over and like sees Jason just like having so much fun and just thinks about Kanan literally like in pain, getting beat the fuck up less than like an hour ago. And I think like there's a flash of remembering, um, Avery avoiding going home to grandma for a moment mm. and like seeing that parallel 
And I think Avery just kind of like gives you like the coldest look, Jason, and just without saying a word, swims away and gets out of the pool. Yeah, I think Jason is just like continuing to splash and like like flail around in the water and then like he just like kind of looks over like mid splash and just like makes eye contact with you for a moment and just kind of like freezes in place for a little bit and then just like slowly just like lets his har- arms down into the water and is just like kind of shocked for a bit and then just like kind of makes his way over to the edge of the pool and just like sits himself up on the side mm-hmm. if looks could kill the vibe hey all right all right uh, i also uh, imagined ooh, jason stinker. like splashing <laughs> Like, Avery's just staring him down. He goes, splash. <laughs> right in her oh, face. No. I actually imagined, like, the Jason splashing. I imagined him doing, like, the thing where you squeeze your hand oh, and, like, a little yeah. bit of water shoots up. And he's just doing that in, like, Cooper's face giggling. But then, like, looks over and sees Avery and, like, gets real solemn. Oh. But, yeah, uh, Avery will grab, like, like kind of angrily and not trying to hide it, will grab her leather jacket and storms out of the pool, like, entirely. Noted. Um, Isla, is there anything else that you're looking to do in this uh, a little uh, bit of wildness that you've created? <laughs> yes. Um, is Xavier <laughs> at the party? Xavier is at the Xavier is the party. He and uh, he and Austin are sort of just, uh, uh, you know, sort of in a corner of the pool, just kind of chilling. You know, both of them kind of have their arms up, you know, uh, uh, on the sides of the pool. Uh, is he shirtless? Yes. I'd like to keep my cool then. Oh. What? 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 And that is seven. Oh, okay. Is Oh, oh. my god. And I think that while is Isla happening? is uh staring quite hard at Xavier's shirtless, she uh slips on the, like the next song. And plays uh, Need You Now by Lady A. Shut up. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> and then quickly oh, changes it to like California oh, shit, Girls. Shit. Oh, fuck yeah. California. But he gets out the, um, yeah, the main message of it. <laughs> oh, snap. I need you now. <laughs> oh, I did not see that coming, oh, Isla Hart. OMG. Oh, OMG. I wonder what about why she's so obsessed with the Ciprianos. <laughs> Yeah, where, but, but but Julian, what happens when he shows back up? A girl what can does look. happen? A girl can <laughs> oh my gosh! A girl can God. set up elaborate pool party schemes to see a boy shirtless. Exactly, Come on. I am the That's mastermind. Normal. Thank you. <laughs> Wonderful. Um, out uh, outside of uh, school, Kanan, uh, you've been chilling. You know, just kind of icing things. How uh, how are you feeling? I mean, no, physically not great, but more emotionally, I guess, is my question. Kanan is like a weird mix of like really disappointed in themselves and like mad at themselves, but also real fucking mad at Gael. And I feel like Kanan is like furiously stirring some buffalo chicken dip, but just like really oh, yeah. mad about it. Yeah. <sighs> you got some like, the, you know, it's, it's so chock a block full, you know, it's like. Some bits are splattering out of the pot. It's going crazy. Uh, man, I just... I had an idea. I hate this idea as a Marcus. But I'm going to roll with it. Keep it. Keep it, Feral. <laughs> so, uh, I am going to roll to keep my cool as well okay. on something. Partial success. Partial. Okay. What, what were you r- rolling to keep your cool about? To see if I wanted to make a dumb decision about getting back at Gael. Okay. Uh, so, does this partial success mean that you don't do that, or that you do that? I think it's, I start my plan, but then back off a bit. Gotcha. So, I text Holden. Okay. Ooh. Hey, what are you up to tonight? Because genuinely, I was going to text Holden to see if he just wanted to fucking jump Gael. But then I backtrack 
but I had already sent the message of like, what are you up to tonight? Uh, yeah, you get a um, back. Uh, nothing much. Is it coffee time? And then you also get, um, it's like a selfie of him and the rest of the stew crew at this pool party. And they're like, and he's like, where are you, by the way? I am going to do my best to recreate that same selfie that he just sent me. But instead of other people around, I'm grabbing like any plushies that are in the house, figurines that might be like decorated, decorated around and like the ice pack and like pillows and I send back just me looking fucked up. That's pretty. El- that's pretty elaborate, there, Kanan. Have Kanan. a piece side. Your yeah. eye is swollen yeah. shut. Hey, you get back. Holy shit! Was that you that got beaten up? Yeah, I've had a pretty rough day, so uh, I could use something to make it better. Uh, yeah, you get back. It sounds good. I'll see you tonight. And then it's like the the emoji that it's like the kind of winky with like the 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 kiss, and the kiss has like a little heart coming off. Kanan has no idea how to respond to that. I said a thumbs up. <laughs> Rad. <laughs> Kanan Rad. says like one of the like most turn on lines we've had in several games. Also, Kanan, thumbs up in response to flirting. (laughs) I also imagine after the emoji, it's like the dot, dot, dot goes away. Dot, dot, dot goes away. (laughs) Dot, dot, dot. Thumbs up. (laughs) Love that. Uh, Jason, you're sitting somberly by the side of the pool. Is there anything else that you're doing right now? No. I think that Jason's just like sitting there and being like, what? Just, we won. (laughs) (laughs) won. And that's just going to be, like, him trying to process what the fuck that was all about. Noted. Um, awesome. Uh, shifting into lunchtime. Everyone is sopping wet. Because <laughs> that happened, like, fourth period. Um, and so, like, it sort of trickled over a little into, the, into your lunch period. Uh, and so everyone's just kind of, like... Like there was a you know, a couple of people who probably you know like are swimmers or like have like a class that's like you know like a diving or like a swimming like a class that they take as like an elective. So like some people probably had some swimsuits, but most people probably just kind of went for it. Um, so a lot of people are just kind of drenched um, and are in the cafeteria. Are you all in the cafeteria? Obviously, aside from Canaan. No. No. I'm in my lunch are you office. Back? You're in your lunch office. Isla Hart, are you in the cafeteria or are you doing some other shenanigans? <laughs> no, um, I'm in the cafeteria and avoiding the puddles like their minds. No, Cleo, Cleo the condensation. <laughs> um, and I am going to bring Grim to my friend table. Oh, okay. <laughs> None of it's just Jason. Oh, you mean to uh, like Bridget? And, yeah, it's like Bridget but, and Kai. My other so, so not the not not the super oh, table. Never yeah. mind. Jason's but, like, sitting by himself. Guys, but the nor- <laughs> but the normal uh, the normal high school friends. Yeah. I was like, it's not just you guys. <laughs> yeah, it's not all about you. Uh, but yeah, it's just awesome. Uh, so you take Grim over to hang out with um with kai and with well, i'm forgetting everyone's name bridget. right now kai and bridget and harper and uh, also see you come and sit down uh, uh of course bridget's like the first to say anything she's like oh my god you brought us more friends i love it you're grim right and grim's like that is yes correct that is me and uh, yeah, you sit down and just have, you start start chatting about whatever, like th- all this and that. Yeah, I think it's all about the pool party. Like, oh my god, did you see that? Let's see, that Mia went in the pool in her underwear. Yeah, she. I gotta say, like, I gotta figure out where she got those because they were really. They were cute. real cute, but like, at school, <laughs> it's just a bunch yeah. of that. <laughs> but at school, though. But they were cute. Oh, You're right. Yeah, and it's like, did you guys see how good Austin and Xavier are? Like, holy fuck, they've been like working out or something. One second. It's a six. Oh no! Oh my god! Mark the failure. Oh my god! Mark the XP. What happens? Tell me more. 
I thought you weren't into him. I'm not. I, I mean, like I was kind of into him. It doesn't mean he's not hot. Is this Bridget? This is Bridget. Okay. Yeah. What like happened when you guys tried it last year? I mean, like it was just like kind of like, we were just talking. Like when like not, nothing like re- like physical happened. We were just kind of flirty, you know. And then, and then like you know like when Austin kind of you know went missing for a bit. Like you know he was really bummed about it, and so he wasn't really like in like the like the flirty text kind of mood. Um, and then yeah, and then Austin came back, and they were just like inseparable, and then they got together. So it just kind of fizzled out. If they like broke up, would you try again? What? What are you? What are you even saying? I don't know. I'm being bad. Isla, don't be bad. They're so cute. Well, you know. Oh, you're a bad bitch. I'm I just speaking you. in hypotheticals. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Uh, learning. But really. What? Are you still into I, Xavier? I don't know. I mean, I gotta say, like, I know that I kind of wrote him off. Cooper's also kind of looking pretty good. Bridget, you minx. We, uh, like, we made out like, <laughs> a little bit, and it was kind of nice. Like, you know, I gotta say, he's interesting. Oh my god, you should he's totally kinda, He's weird, but like, but like, hot weird. I'll go talk to and him it, for you. Oh, okay, no, stop. Oh my god, he loves me. Stop, you psycho. I resent that. I'm sorry. You're right. I take it back. That's right. Uh, Jason, you're Grim being solid. Motionless off to the side. Yeah, at your table <laughs> by yourself. Um, I think, like, you know, like, while you're sitting there just kind of in your solitude, I think there is a moment where, like, you know, you're just kind of scanning the cafeteria. Because, like, what else are you going to fucking look at? Yeah. Um, And I think there's a moment where... You make eyes with Sophia, like your eyes kind of meet, and you see just like a a glint of satisfaction. Hmm. <laughs> Do I know about Avery's new office location? I mean, it's the that... same office location. Okay, I wasn't know. I wasn't sure if it was public. No, it's the same, same place. She just hasn't been back. back. Like she wasn't there most of last. Like the the back half of the the year last year. Mm-hmm. Okay, I guess I guess my question is, do I know that she's opened up office hours again? I don't think. Like, I, I guess that's more of an Avery. Um, question. she has not technically opened up office hours. She's just sure. in there to go over these files that she got. Um, okay, but she's not at lunch, and when she isn't at lunch, yeah, that's fair. I think that. Uh, Jason just finishes up the rest of his food, uh, winks back at Sophia, I guess, um, and is going to go try to check the office and see if Avery's in there. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. You head over that way. Knock, knock, knock. Avery, you're hanging in there. Uh, Up until then, you were reading through files. Yes? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So I said, what, you had Sophia and you had Gia's. Gia's, yeah. Awesome. So you see uh, Sophia's... um, like her record looks, for the most part, like pretty fucking normal. Like she's been always been a, a pretty well, uh, good student. Uh, her old school was very well liked by faculty and students alike. You do notice like a lot of the paper in there seems to have been like it like, you know, like when it comes to like you know like a student's like record, like you know there have been pages that have been there for years. A lot of these like seem like fresh, like the pages are fresh. Hmm. Um, and when it comes to Gia's, there's not a lot of history for her up until probably about sixth grade. Um, and it looks like she, uh, like, uh, essentially was taken in by Sophia's family. Um, so there's not a lot in there, um, before that time. But after Does, that, again, it seems like a, a relatively normal sort of story. Yeah, this is something I can find out by looking at this. Uh, they have different last names, right? They do have different last names, okay. yes. But like her guardian is yeah, Sophia's as a, parents, basically. Yeah, like they yeah, have yeah. legal you, custody. Probably not an adoption, but as yeah, probably a, a guardian, you know, a, a ward, as one might refer to them uh, in <clears> older sure. parlance. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, so essentially is yeah uh, uh, the guardian uh, by Sophia's family. Okay. Um, but as in like an, an adoption sort of situation. I pull up a notepad on my phone. And I make like a list. Well, I add to the list that I already have that has other things on it. 
and I just put um, G's parents, question mark. I'm just looking into that later, but um, yeah, and so I, I'm just looking through files and then the knock on the door, I think scares Avery a little bit because like she was not, she in here with contraband and wasn't planning <laughs> on talking to anybody. So I think she's like, uh, yeah, uh, uh, who, who, who is, I'm with, who is it? It's me. <laughs> How do I feel about Jason right now, Zach? You, uh, there's still like a like a tinge of that. Like, like it is nowhere near as strong okay. as it was when it like spiked. And so you know, you're, you feel like you're sort of on the tapering, you know, uh, like it, it, it's uh, quelling a bit. Okay. Like it, there's a little bit there. Like you know, you're still, you feel a little frustrated with him still. Yeah. But like it's nowhere near like that, like total disgust you were feeling a little bit ago. Is there any part of me that recognizes this as being some sort of third party influence or does it truly like feel like it was me um yeah i mean like it's one of those things like i i think this just feels like it was you okay like cool. it was like something in that moment just set you off okay sounds good i open the door and let jason in uh come on in yeah hey hi Um, you, you, you doing okay? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm fine. I stole some, actually, come, I, I like kind of pull you in a little bit further and I close the door behind you. I stole some files earlier, so I was looking through them. What? Okay. Um, cool. We'll come back to that in a second. What happened at the pool? I don't know what you're referring to. What? We, we won chicken. And then, like, I look over and, like, you're, like, fully, like, pissed at me. What? <clears throat> I, I guess I don't really know what to tell you. I just got mad for a second there. Oh, okay. Was it something I did? Was it? <laughs> this is. Are there stuff going on? No, no. It was fully 100% you. I just. <laughs> Okay, so what about me? I'm trying to find a way to describe what just happened so that I don't offend you or anything because we are friends. I've been I've been almost killed. I can take a little bit of like feelings hurty. I don't know why, but for one second, everything you were doing was pissing me the fuck off, and I can't explain why, but I needed to get as far away from you as possible. Okay. Okay. That. How are, uh, what are, what are the files you got? Yeah, um, Sophia and Gia, and I'll kind of hand the files over, and Avery is, like, avoiding eye contact as very hard and kind of sure. and he just flips through them too and is just like they seem like students anything jump out at you yeah um some of the files in Sophia's look how new they look like they were printed recently they shouldn't have been huh yeah it's like it's you think she's a real person I was gonna look into that Apparently, Sophia's parents took in Gia when she was six-ish. And, uh, sixth grade. Sixth grade, which is different from six <laughs> because I know that. Right. Right. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure I said sixth grade. That's I what I know. meant to say. I hope I didn't say Let's do two takes of what I just said so you pick the right okay. one. <laughs> awesome. Apparently, um, Sophia's parents took Gia in. <laughs> Sorry, I take can't. it serious. If you can't. want a solid take, actually do it. Do it a, a good it. take. Can't do it. Um, apparently, so. <laughs> Shut up. I can't. I can't. Even. We're moving on. Okay. Huh. It all makes the episode. That's interesting. But I mean, that you did you did you get anybody else, or is it just these two? <sighs> just these. I okay. was working under borrowed time. Mrs. Hudson kind of caught me behind the counter. Huh. Maybe. Maybe they, maybe maybe, her parents adopted all of them, the whole crew under one roof. That's a good theory. Is it? I I said that as a joke. I'm not sure. I 
Do you think that could actually be what's going on? I mean, on? at one point, all of us were under your roof. Huh. An anything in Gia's? <sighs> Other than the switcheroo and guardianship, not really. Okay. I don't know much about where she came from, but I'm trying to decide if I feel slimy enough to look into it. Well, if you feel slimy enough, I'm sure you'll find something. Or if there's something to be found, I'm sure you can find it. <sighs> J uh, uh, Jason, I'm sorry about what I said earlier. I, you know how sometimes just things get under your skin. I'm no, I get, I get it, I get it. It happens sometimes. You're just like hanging out and you get a phone call and you're like fuck a phone call and then it ruins like your next six hours like I get it yeah but a phone call isn't a friend so I'm I'm sorry look I can I'll be fine as long as am I pissing you off now only a little dang well Avery kind I'll of smiles some... at that though like <laughs> dang well I'll do some uh, self reflection on my most irritating traits <laughs> and Next time we see each other, it, it'll still be there. It's good. I wouldn't want you to change no matter what, Jason. Please don't. In fact. Will ado. <laughs> okay, so uh, all of that weirdness aside, Kanan, what what the hell happened with Kanan? Oh my god, I think that he I think that they got in a fight with Gael. Guile's been weird. We know that Guile's been Guile's weird been for weird. a while and super aggro and also buff as hell. So fucking buff. Um, so I don't get why Kanan didn't fight back, but. I mean, I do. Right now, because of that video that Isla took, Guile is the one that is going to go down for any of that that happened. Do you actually think that Guile is going to go down for any of this? There's been so much weird shit happening with him and with school records and with like even even before like the weird like maybe Sophia's record is too new that's weird like even before then like my tests and stuff were just like getting like swapped out or rewritten or like changed up like do you think I was ever gonna take a fall because someone caught him like in a fight you you might be onto something here Jason what does kind of all of that have in common School, Gael. School. Has anybody gotten in trouble for any of that? We couldn't even sneeze last year without seeing the inside of a detention room. What's going on at the school? I, well, I mean, I did get, I did get interrogated by cops that one time because they thought they had. That was yesterday. <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> I was gonna say that one time. I don't one know if Avery ago. knew that. So Avery goes, "What?" Oh, there was. Someone found slash reported weed in my locker. It wasn't mine, um, but then that was a whole thing. Okay. But that's that's still school like interference. But just to get me in trouble. Okay. A lot of, a no, lot of this yeah, is getting no, me in you're, trouble. No, you're probably right. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm going to add it to the planner anyway. And Avery pulls out the notepad that she's having and adds another topic to her ever-growing list of things <laughs> to, to look into. A lot of it was getting me in trouble. I mean, other than the stuff with Gael, it has been exclusively things with you, Jason. Why were you mad at me? I, I mean, I, I told you it was just kind of like I looked at you, and all of a sudden I, oh, oh, I see where you're going with this. I don't really have a reason, I, Jason. Well, I'm sure someone does. I think you should be as slimy as possible with this record hunt. All right. I was going to say something like, like, I was going to, like, do one of those really cool, like, sign off moments um, and say something like, let's go get slimy. But that felt wrong. So I'm not going to say that. Put it on a billboard. <laughs> We're going places. <laughs> we Put it on a billboard. Maybe. We're going places. <laughs> that needs to be a T-shirt. Put it on a billboard. Yeah. And it's on a billboard. And that's, and Put it on a T-shirt. Put that on a t-shirt. I was honestly thinking that earlier when it's like Isla said, I could use that as my sign off. This is Isla Hart. Put it on a billboard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, I uh, Ivory? Ivory. <laughs> Ooh. Isla and Ivory. Avery, shit name. Avery. Yeah. There it is. That's what it is. Ivory. Uh, Avery just kind of like smiles a 
not gleefully wicked smile, but kind of. Um, and just goes, okay, yeah, I can do that. Doctor's orders, right? In the meantime, Jason, you need to be careful. Clearly, somebody is out to get you at this school. And right now, <laughs> you're still standing on two feet, but it's escalating. I'll watch my feet. <laughs> Avery just kind of pats your shoulder, and then um, <laughs> she'll... <laughs> oh, no. Are my clothes still wet? Yes. Freaking frack them. I need to get these files out of my office. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your clothes are. Dr- I mean, your jacket is dry because you left it. Yeah, so I'll I'll wrap the files up in my jacket, a la the head from last season, <laughs> and we'll walk out of the room. Thank you so much for listening to these silent secrets. If you like what you heard, you want to support us. There's a bunch of ways to do that. The easiest ways. Um, wherever you're listening to us, if you can just scroll down, like, review, subscribe, rate, whatever your options are, just please utilize those options. They do a huge amount for boosting us and making sure other people can find our show. We'd really, really appreciate it. Another super duper easy way is just to tell a couple of friends about us. You know, the, the, the more friends you tell about us and then they'll tell a couple of friends and then we can gather together just like one big, awesome... And we can all just, like, be buds and hang out and play, like, some big, massive game of, like, Red Rover or something. You guys remember that game? It has a lot of childhood nostalgia, but was also incredibly painful and dangerous. Let's bring it back. If you want to support us further, we're on Patreon at patreon.com slash ghostlightmedia, where you can donate to us monthly and get some incredible rewards for yourself by talking to us all in a private Discord server, all the way up to an exclusive mug club, where you get some awesome mugs. We also have a merch store at tpublic.com slash store slash ghostlight. Get yourself a t-shirt, get yourself a tapestry, whatever you want. You can probably get it there. You can find us all over online. You can find our website at thesilentsecrets.com. You can find our TikTok at These Silent Secrets, as well as our new Blue Sky at These Silent Secrets. And if you're still on the hellscape that it was Twitter, we're still there at Silent Secret Pod. You can find all of us individually as well. You can find Marcus at Marcus RVO, Nicole at Nicole Voice, Mariah at underscore Mariah Clausen, Freddie at Freddie underscore Pow Pow, and myself at that guy, Zach Rob. We'll be back in two weeks with another episode, but until then, may your secrets stay hidden, and may you always have very impromptu pool parties during your high school school day. This has been a Ghost Light Media Production.